Hello. Procreate, um, to uh, create a multicolor dual brush, like this uh, um, coconut palm tree. Okay. Um, I'm, okay. First, uh, when you create a brush, you need a, a square canvas use uh, 2048 by 2048 pixels. Um, this is um, create your um, design and how the brush uh, should look like. Um, and um, now the, uh, the brush is working like this. It's only um, a small example for, um, for this brush. Okay, I turn off this. Um, to create um, the brush, um, you need grayscale uh, images uh, and place them in the center of, the, of your canvas. Uh, this is the top of the palm um, and I have to do this. Um, um, select your um, select your part and duplicate it. Mm. Duplicate it and now you can place it in the center like this and uh, scale it a little bit. I think this looks fine. And then uh, you can change uh, the color uh, the, to reduce um, the Sättigung of German um, to make it grayscale and you can um, make it a little bit darker than the colors um, are more colorful. <laughs> okay, uh, oops, there's a, a small thing I have to delete. And okay, this is the first part of the palm. And the second one is um, the trunk. Um, I only created one piece of it um, because it's repeating. Um, okay. Let's start um, with the top of the palm. Um, you can go um, in the wrench uh, menu and copy the canvas. And um, then go to your brushes and create a new one. Plus and insert the form, press um, here and um, import it and press import and now press with two fingers on you can with two fingers you can switch then you got uh, this ready and the pass you can uh, set to max and the Apple Pencil decrease this slider, Deckcraft, and in the properties um, you can uh, change the size. Um, I give it uh, 550%. And now you got a stamp of uh, the top of the palm. Press ready. First part of the brush. Um, the next uh, step is we need the trunk. Same process. Copy the canvas. Go to the brushes. Create a new brush. Change the form. Import it. Insert it. Press with two fingers on it. Press ready. And in the pass settings, um, sorry, I go to this and uh, 
make it a little bit bigger and first we have to change the maximum size 550 and the Apple Pencil reduce the I think uh, opacity no um, okay reduce this slider and now in the pass settings um, you can adjust your um, the stroke and when you're fine press ready and test it you Okay, uh, rotate your, your um, okay, I think it works. It's fine. And go back to your settings and now you can change in the form. Uh, no, not the form. Um, in the Apple Pencil, uh, the size with the pressure. It's, uh, you can adjust everything um, on, on this, it, um, that's fine tuning. Okay, we got two brush parts. And one important thing is um, you can change the color only um, in, um, in one um, brush. Um, and I change it um, in this case um, at the trunk brush and the color changing brush have to be the first brush. Then select the second one and you see different blue colors. Uh, the lighter blue is a color changing blue uh, uh, brush and combine these brushes. And now you can um, Test your brush and yes, it's fine. And uh, you can switch between the brushes and you can here adjust the stabilization of the stroke uh, of the trunk. Um, you can test it here, uh, what it does. And now let's change the color. Um, go to color dynamics change the sliders to the second color all up the second color is um, is a random color but you can uh, minimize the randomization I think it's the right word um, to have only one specific color it's um, it's uh, just a uh, yes <laughs> yeah, you can't uh, set a second color, one specific color. Okay, let's test it. And now the brush is ready. That's it. Um, the rest of this is um, adjusting and uh, yes, and testing what happens. Okay, sorry. For my English, um, this, um, um, yes, I hope you understand. Have fun with painting. Ciao.